Hi, I'm Brian. Welcome to Syntax Technologies. Today, we'll continue with our SQL accounting system training. Today's topic will be maintain stock item. Let's get started. In SQL accounting software, if you do not purchase stock control module, you're still able to access to stock, maintain stock group, and maintain stock item. Just the rest will be disappeared. Sometimes my customer will ask me, Brian, I do not maintain stock control. I do not sell stock. I provide services. Then, why should I maintain stock item? This is because in maintain stock item, it is not only meant for stock item, but also for services purpose. Let's say you provide services. For example, for myself, I provide e-invoice seminar. So what I can do is I go to maintain stock item, new. I create a stock item called e-invoice seminar. Just that this is service, so I untake stock control. Over here, I need to select it belongs to which stock group. If you want to know more about stock group, please refer to my previous video. Then, base UOM is base unit of measurement. This is like one unit, one pack, one packet. So for Samina, maybe it will be one session or one time. Okay. Reference cost is the purchase cost. This is services, so there's no cost. Then I just put in the reference price. Let's say it's 5,000 ringgit. If you want to key in more description about this service or item, you can go to more description and key in the details accordingly so that you do not need to key in the details every time when you do a transaction. You can predefine in maintain store item. Save it. This is one of your service. Or let's say you sell computer mouse. Okay, you have this item and you want stock control, you just take stock control. Base UM, let's say you put unit, the purchase cost maybe is 50 ringgit and you are selling at 100 ringgit. So you can set like this. But sometimes you do not purchase in unit, you purchase in box and you sell in unit. So you will have different unit of measurement. In order to do this, you must have the stock control module with multi UOM. What you can do is you can just click the plus sign and put box. So one box actually is 12 unit, then you can set like this. So what will happen is you save this and you check on your stock item. You can see this mouse, the quantity balance is zero. Close it, go to purchase. Let's say you do a purchase for mouse. You buy, let's say two box is 100 ringgit per box. Save it, done. And you can see that when you check your stock item, your mouse will become 24 because of the base unit. So remember, your base UOM is unit. So that's why when you do checking, it is based on the base UOM. And you only can check the stock balance according to base UOM and not others UOM. So when you sell, you sell to a particular customer. Let's say you sell three unit of mouse. Three unit, save it, and you check your stock again. Now become 21. So this is how SQL accounting software maintains stock item works. And you should have the stock control module if you want to know the stock balance quantity. If you are interested in SQL accounting software, or you want to sign maintainer with us, please contact us directly. Once again, thank you for watching. I'm Brian from Syntax Technologies. See you in the next video. Thank you.